All right, as you can see, the sun is out and it is bright today. I'm gonna try to block it off of you. I don't know if that's gonna work. Maybe I turn it that way. There, less sun for you, more sun for me. Because it's freaking cold out here. It's like 50 degrees, which is cold in Florida. Anyway, good morning and welcome to my final daily vlog. This is number 365. One year ago today, I set out to do a video every day for 365 days. And there were some days that, man, I was like, why did I do this? It's three in the morning and I'm just uploading this video. So I will say that it has been probably one of the hardest things I've ever done. It has been very rewarding. Um, I've got to connect with you guys on a whole nother level. I also did something else that I wanted to accomplish today. Um, as you're watching this, I am probably just getting done with my bike ride and that bike ride puts me over a thousand miles ridden on a bicycle this year as well. So as you guys know, last year I started a journey to lose some weight too. And I lost like 36 pounds before we left last April and uh, I gained about half of it back. So my net loss for the year was 18 pounds. I'm happy with that. If I can do that again this year, then this time next year, I'll be another 18 pounds lighter, which would be the total loss of 36 pounds. I know when I'm on the road, I'm going to put weight on um, and I just go off my diet because it's almost impossible to stay on my diet when I'm on the road. So I just enjoy it while I'm on the road and then I work it off when I get back home for the five, six months I'm home. So that's the plan anyway. Anywho. It is cold and I want some coffee. So we'll see you guys in a few. Hey guys, I'm sick, but I wanted to come on here and say, congratulations, Sonny, you did it. Um, so he has no idea I'm doing this. He took off to go get chili at Wendy's because in Florida, it's actually chilly here and it sounded really good. And he's like out the door, like I'm getting it. So anyways, I'm, he's gonna be editing this and seeing this and I just wanted to come on and say congratulations. Good job, honey. Um, 365 days to do something like this every single day is a lot of work and I'm very, very, very proud of you and what you've done. Um, I think you've done an awesome job at um, being here and letting everybody know what's going on in our life and how we're here to help support and how we're here to um, provide resources and um, you know give you guys um, you know I, I live vicariously through us and um, it's been fun it's been enjoyable of course there's been its ups and downs you guys have seen it all um, but uh, the hardest part for him was you know doing these videos every single day so I'm really really proud um, Granny Ma Badger and I were like, let's do some party or we need some like, uh, I don't know, um, <laughs> do something crazy fun. And of course, Sonny's not that not that way. If you guys haven't noticed, he's, um, yeah, he doesn't want to make a big, big deal out of it. And um, we're the opposite. So he kind of makes us like, <laughs> <laughs> not do things that we want to do but um that's okay that's sunny as you guys have gotten to know and i don't know what he's doing next it's completely up to him i have no say i don't i you know whatever whatever feels best for him um if he continues on i think that'll be awesome because 2024 is going to be amazing of course as you guys know we've been planning it all out and i'm excited to share a lot of stuff with you guys that's coming up um but if he doesn't, that's fine too. You guys know where to find us and if you need us, and I'm sure we'll be putting content out. But anyways, love you, honey. Mwah. All right, guys. So on my last day, I did some shopping. I got some tools for my RC car. I got a bag for my RC car. Check this thing out. It's got pockets here for tools and everything. And then the there's the car, it's even got a strap to hold the car down. Um, pockets on each side with an over the shoulder strap. Uh, it's black and orange, so you know that's my bag. Uh, but nice big bag, found it on Amazon. Found those there too. Anyway, 
So I've got some stuff to keep my car all tidy and together. And if you know anything about me, I like my tools in the same place. I like a neat workspace. This allows me that. Oh, the other thing that's pretty cool is underneath here, you probably can't see it, but there's actually like a pit board that comes out that you can put up as you're pitting your bike, your bike, jeez, as you're pitting your car. <laughs> can't tell I'm a biker, got bike on the mind. Anyway, as, you, as you're pitting your car, you can set that out, put your car on there, get your work done, you know, all that fun stuff. Oh, part of the toolkit was the a stand for the car. Anywho, lots of new tools. Hey, and oh, this is a good quote for today. oh, Mama Badger's got her quote for the day. Let's see what it says. First, I'll show it to you. When life shuts a door in your face, open it. That's how doors work, right? <laughs> That's how doors work, right? Read that again. When life shuts a door in your face, open it. Because that's how doors work. Yeah, it's a great quote. All right, guys. So I said that I would end my video talking about motorcycles. So let's talk about motorcycles. Let's talk about motorcycles in 2024. I have a question for all of you. Is there anything that you've heard or that you're thinking about that is exciting in the motorcycle world coming up. Like, I can be honest, there's nothing. I've seen nothing that even gives me an inkling of excitement in the motorcycle world coming up. Indian just announced all of their new upgrades and models for the year. It was a um, I have a feeling Harley's going to be the exact same way. I don't anticipate anything new coming down. I know bike sales are down considerably. Like, I think Harley was 16%, and uh, I, I think Indian's like 10 to 12%. I did see something. I haven't researched this, guy, so don't quote me on it. But I did see something that um, Indian is wanting to eliminate their dealerships and it just be ordered direct from the factory. Like I said, I've just heard some rumblings of this. I don't have any proof. I haven't done my research, so don't quote me on it. But that was the rumor I heard, uh, and it makes sense to me. I've always said that, you know, I thought Harley would do it. If Harley didn't sell so many accessories and they didn't have all of the really cool dealerships and all, they would probably do that. But it's hard to shut down those dealerships because they bring so many people in to the brand um, just in themselves. So Harley doesn't just have to count on the Harley name brand. They have all these cool dealerships that people go and visit and then they see a cool bike and then all of a sudden that bike is sitting in the garage. But Anyway, that's the rumors I've heard. I'm just curious if there's anything coming out that you've heard of that excites you. Or let me ask you this, is there anything that if one of the companies came out with it would be a no-brainer, you'd buy it? Is there any feature, any motor size, any anything that would just be like, you know what, I gotta have that, where do I sign? I'm curious. Anyway guys, thank you for spending 365 days with me. I appreciate all of your time and uh, just hanging out with me and mama and baby and the whole Badger family. It has been um, my honor and pleasure to do this with you for 365 days. And uh, you know, I usually say I'll see you tomorrow. I won't see you tomorrow, but I will see you later on the road somewhere. Bye.